Theophilus. And welcome to this week's video. Hi guys, my name is Kira the Wolf and I used to work at a gas station called Sheets. Sheets is a gas station restaurant. You may be thinking, Kiro, wait, a gas station restaurant? Yes, Sheets is a place where you can get gas for your car and get made to order food. Basically how it works, you go into the store, choose what you want on the screen, add what stuff you want to your food, and then BAM! Delicious food! And as I mentioned, I did work there for a short time, and I mainly made food, so today I want to share some of the weirdest orders I had to ever make. And the most ludicrous requests ever. So I got an order for a meatball sub. You may be thinking, oh that's easy, right? WRONG! You're so wrong! I remember the exact order list for this. Italian bread, meatballs, marinara sauce, and literally every single sauce we had. We had 14 sauces, by the way. This was a mess of a sub. It was flooding with sauce. I'm not Moses. I can't pot them sauces. But I ended up putting everything on that he wanted, and I wrapped it up and gave him four spoons because honestly, it was a soup at that point. I called the order number out, and he came up, and I handed it to him. And I said... Enjoy your soup. He gave me a weird look and then walked away. Literally 10 minutes later, he came back to complain that his bread was soggy. And he wanted a whole new sandwich. Bitch, no. I got so mad that I picked him up and threw him out the window. He rolled into the parking lot and then fell off a cliff. <laughs> Just kidding. I had my manager come over and tell him the basics of bread. Literally, this guy didn't have common sense at all. Next was the smash sandwich. So this was a doll order, just a normal six inch ham sub with a lot of veggies. So it's just people can watch you make food and when I was wrapping it up, the guy yelled over, you didn't fall the sandwich. And I really didn't because the way we wrap our subs, it kind of just closes itself when you wrap it. So I looked at my manager and she says, what are you waiting for? Fold a sandwich. So I unwrapped it and by the way, when I unwrapped it, the sandwich was folded. So I showed him, he says, nah, that's not folded. Push on it. So I pushed on the sub. And then he said, boy, have you ever made a sub in your life? Close the damn sub. And at, the, at this point, I just wanted to stand up on the counter and yell, it's your sub, why don't you close it? But I didn't. It ended up getting to the point where he wanted me to squish his sub. So what did I do? I Hulk smashed his sub. No banner, only hero. And finally, what did he have to say for all my hard work? He said, how does it feel to properly close a sub? You must feel so much better about yourself, huh? Ah, hero smash. Ah, no banner, only hero. Ah, this was ridiculous. I mean, really? Really? You had to say that? What, what the heck is wrong with people? That was just ridiculous. Last one. I, I swear, this, this is the last one <laughs> of the ridiculous orders. The single tomato. I call it the single tomato because, you know, it, it is a definite single potato uh, on this one, huh? <laughs> so this order was easy. Turkey sub with mayo, four slices of tomato. As I was about to put the tomato on, the guy yelled over and said, can you put a single tomato on the end of the bread? I didn't really think anything of it. I yelled over and said, okay. But as I was putting the slice of tomato on, he yelled again and said, No, 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 a whole tomato. And I, I'm just, um, I, I, um, mm, boy, uh, <laughs> bitch, no, this isn't how this works. I'm sorry, this is, this is a sub, it's not called a sub with a whole tomato. You're gonna either have one slice or go away. How the hell do you eat a sub with a whole tomato on it? Are you going to propose to your wife with one singular tomato? What are you doing? Stop. I ended up telling him no and gave him one slice of tomato and handed it to him and he walked away. All sad like, but I don't care. You're not getting a whole freaking tomato on your, your sub. That, that's just, that's just crazy. Mm, no. <laughs> oh my God. Working at Sheets has just been 
interesting because you get to know the public really well. They are very kinky with their food. They like to mix and match things. They're very uh, interesting. And you can see why a lot of people that work these kind of jobs hate people. <laughs> because people make it so hard for, for our jobs because we're constantly like, oh my god, I swear if they add any more things to this sandwich, I won't be able to close it. And I'm going to explode. Oh my god. Anyway guys, that was my short story time from when I worked at Sheets. I ended up not working there anymore because of things that were happening at the current time. But regardless, it was a great gas station where you could get amazing food. This video isn't sponsored by Sheets. I just like their food. But I didn't like working there at all. Oh my god. <laughs> also, sorry I didn't do a fursuit video this video because I was at Denver the last week and I forgot to charge all my camera equipment. So everything's dead. So here's another stills video. Woo! Heck yeah, story times are cool. Ba 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 bam. I'm so weird, I'm sorry. But anyway guys, if you like this video, give it a big thumbs up. If you disliked it, you know what to do. I mean, it's okay. You give it a thumbs down. But if you, if you want, you can give it a huge thumbs up. I always appreciate a good thumbs up, boy. Anyway, you guys have an amazing night. And before I go, I do have a Patreon, which you can, you can check out the links down below. It's pretty amazing. I also have merch shirts. I'm just saying. Just super saying. I mean, am I super saying blue yet? I'm not sure. Gonna have to check on that. But uh bing, bada, boom. Oh my goodness. <laughs> but anyway, guys, you have an amazing night. And I will see you in next week's video. Have a great day and goodbye. Hey, I'm Kid Wolf. And thank you for watching this week's video.